how we doing? Me and Tom have just drove over to uh, Glencoe, uh, day two, little camp, but we kind of got carried away taking pictures on our way over, so we've kind of like ran out of time to get a big mountain in, so we found a lay-by down near the road, dropped it in there and seen a hill and just thought, sack it, let's send it up there. Views look pretty decent, overlooking Rannock Moor, if that's how you pronounce it. Um, so yeah, we'll head on up uh, and I'll uh, bring you back as we're going. signal tonight are we? 5G mass down there. And we're back. We've just reached the top. It's not a big one. Garmin saying 498. Um, but there's mad views, mad views. Uh, potentially might be able to get the drone out. Fingers crossed, no wind tonight. So I'll show you some more aerial stuff. We've just found a pitch just off to the side. It's quite flat up here. Um, so yeah, I'll pitch up the tent. Uh, I'll bring you back when it's all pitched and you can see what I'm seeing. We're back, we're on the top. We found a little spot just behind us. I've changed tent tonight. Couldn't be asked with uh, how wet it went. It was condensation heaven last night because uh, I couldn't get the vent open. Uh, it was just loads of spin drift. Just get coming in the vent and I thought, nah, sack it. Uh, but Tom stayed in the same tent. Uh, we had a little bit of a breeze come through here. Just opened his tent up and uh, aired it out and it's just dry to be fair so yeah all good but yeah lovely i'm going to uh get the drone up and uh get some aerial views for you get a little spin round see what you can see but yeah stunning no wind fingers crossed cozy night's sleep catch you in a bit That's us in the tent now. 
just got the stove on. Can't be arse with a meal, so I'm uh, just going to have a dessert instead, I think. Strawberry rice pudding, one of my favourites. But yeah, me and Tom have just been stood outside watching the stars. Somewhere else, when it's dark sky and it's winter, they just pop out like no tomorrow. Tom thinks he's seen a few shooting stars, but I haven't seen any myself. So, we'll see, but we've probably seen some nice aerial photography or videos or whatever I've chucked in there. But yeah, I'll probably see you in the morning because I'm going to get some sleep and listen to some music. Latest peeps. <coughs> Well, good morning. Another cosy night last night. Snug as a bug in a rug, as they say. But yeah, stunning views this morning. I think we had a bit of snow during the night, or hail, or sleet, or whatever it is, but not a lot of it, but it's over the ground. Tent's covered in it, it's pretty frozen. Uh, but sun's not out yet, got another 25 minutes. Um, See what it looks like, it looks a bit overcast though, so might not get any colour or anything like that, but I might sling the drone up, see what we can see. Right then, come on, let's go, let's get this tent down, head back down. It's not very far to go, so probably won't be much filming on the way down because it only took us 30 minutes to get up, but probably 15 minutes to probably get back down. But yeah, let's get this tent down and I'll probably bring you back when we're down near the car. Tent's packed, got a load of snow coming in, I think, so we're uh, gonna bomb it down to the car. But as always, you know the score, Take your shit with you. But come on, let's go. Right, 
Right, that's us back down there at the car now. Yeah, lovely camp mat. I suggest anybody to do that if they're coming to Glencoe. It's only about 500 metres, 30 minutes from the car. Lay by on the road. But yeah, bumped into a couple of uh, Scottish fellas up there this morning. We were on a bit of a hike. And uh, there's a little uh, monument at the end of, uh, I think it's called Meal Moor. And uh, they were saying that, that they think it's a monument to Ian Fleming, who wrote the James Bond books. Um, Rumour says that he possibly owned the land back in the day. So, I wonder if that might be some kind of correlation to the, the films, where you see James Bond driving through Glencoe, maybe. I don't know, I'm going to Google it when I get home anyway, see if... Uh, See what the crack is. Well, yeah, hope you've enjoyed this. Second day over, heading back home. Peace out, guys.